Hello everyone, hope you're doing good. Today in this video we are going to reset the administrator account password. If you're unable to log into your login account, especially on Windows 10, all you need to have is the patience. Please make sure you watch the whole video and you will be able to fix your problem. So whenever we enter, we try to enter the password, we get error. This password is incorrect. Try again. Here we are going to do some very easy steps which we need to follow. You need to listen to me very carefully. Turn off the computer from the power button. Now once the computer is turned off, you need to turn on. And the moment you see the logo screen, that system is thinking to turn on, just turn off the computer. Now you need to do this process three times, like turning on the computer, and when it starts booting and the moment you see the logo turn it off by pressing and holding the power key when you will do this three times you will get the advanced option now once you have turned off your computer three times you will get this window choose an option continue troubleshoot and turn off and here we need to select troubleshoot and you will get the first option reset this PC and advanced option so we need to click on that advanced option so here we have options startup repair uninstall updates startup settings system restore command prompt and system image recovery now we don't have to do anything with system image recovery even if you have it if you have a disk or you don't have it not a problem so we just need to click on this. Now the moment you click on that system image recovery, you will get a window like this. Windows cannot find a system image on this computer. Now here we have this retry and cancel option. So we just need to cancel and here we need to select select a system image and I'll just click on next. And here we have advanced option. So we need to click on that and we get search for a system image and install a driver so we are not going to install any driver however we are going to make some changes so that's why we are selecting install a driver once you do that it will ask you to click on add drivers so we just need to click on that and a window will appear like this let me maximize it so once you're here you need to go to this, this PC and just see where exactly you find the Windows folder. Now in my computer it is in D drive. If I go to C, I do not find it. I'll just go back. I'll see E drive doesn't have anything. So this local disk D has the Windows folder and I'll just double click on that. And here we need to scroll down and looking for system 32 so once you find the system 32 just double click on it here we are looking for a file name utilman so you can select any of the file or folder and press U as an umbrella and then scroll down so you need to look down and look for this file I know it will take time but once and it is there in your system 32 folder now please make sure you find this util man and you just need to do a single click or just do a right click and click on rename and just change it to util man a like you can add anything just to make it unique and click anywhere so in this manner this will be changed I'll just do a right click and I'll just click on refresh and I'll see how exactly the util man I can see the util man A has been changed now once this is done we just need to close this I'll just cancel it here and here we need to click on exit and continue to Windows 10 now once you see the window like this just click anywhere and you will be prompted to enter the password again in the John I mean the user account which you have so at the bottom right corner you have this ease of access and you just need to click on that now once the command prompt is opened 
here we need to type net space user and hit enter now the moment you do it it will give you the whole accounts the number of accounts you have on your windows 10 so here you need to make sure the spelling of your user account name and then type net space user then your account name so in my case it is john so i have typed net space user space john space asterisk and i'll hit enter and the moment i do it it will ask me to enter the password so i'll enter the password and i'll hit enter then i'll again we need to confirm the password the same password and i'll hit enter and you can see the command completed successfully so we have successfully reset and changed the password now we just need to restart the computer so now when you have restarted the computer and it has turned back on here it will ask you to enter the password so enter the same password which you just entered and hit enter and you will be able to see your computer screen so I can see I am successfully logged into my account where I was earlier I was not able to so you can do the same exact thing let me know if you have followed the exact same steps and if you're able to do so and if you have any kind of issues you can let me know in the comment section I'll try my best to fix your problem and I'll see you in the next video please hit the like and subscribe have a wonderful day